Hello guys, this is DJ from Better at Beach. Uh, today's practice is going to be hand setting. We'll work on a little bit uh, adjustments on the hand sets and uh, trying to have that motion correctly and the speed of the arms correctly. We'll be working today with Angie and Kat. So check the second part of the practice so you can see the improvement they have and adjustments they make in the footwork and the arm work. Good, nice. Open the fingers. The per it was everything was perfect. Just your thumb ended up here. Okay. Good. That's okay. Next one, I want you to point here. Slow, slow. Go again. Go again. Go again. Slower. Half half of that speed. Better. You still have way more time, trust me. You're connected with the ball for... Nice, that was really nice. Uh, the set was perfect. I would say that your body is still vertical, okay? So if you imagine the line going like laser, going through your hips and shoulders, your laser would go up. And we want your laser to go a little bit forward. Okay, so once you finish set, your body is supposed to be leaning forward instead of just up. Hands did a good job, now add the body, okay? Nice, okay, that was perfect. Come here, hold the ball. You're supposed to hold the ball that you don't touch this molten part, okay? So a little bit wider. What I see when you wait for the ball, you kind of hold your thumbs a little bit too close. You're like this. You already have to imagine that you want to give that space, you know, to that molten part. So once the ball sinks inside, now you have all this extension, 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 extension. Okay, so make sure you give that space with thumbs while waiting for the ball. Okay, we don't want to wait for the ball with the closed thumbs. That was a good set, I like that. Even more forward, try to go again and freeze after the set. Don't move so I can show you. Don't move, don't move. <laughs> go again. And don't move, don't move. Okay, but where's our target? Here. Yeah, so your feet, shoulders, fingers, everything is supposed to point to the target, okay? Make sure you understand that, that you prepare. It's preparation more than finish. If you do it before the ball comes, the only thing you need to do is now extend. But if you don't, now you have to fix everything, okay? So just prepare better on the ball while the ball is flying. Thumbs, thumbs, thumbs. Good, go again. Super fast. You're connected to the ball for one or two seconds and we want four. Let's see four. From the bottom all the way up, really slow. Hey, better. Better, now let's keep the finish frozen. Okay, the speed was good now. Hold the finish, hold the finish. Both of you, don't pull your hands straight after the set. Hold the finish a little after. Slow motion, let's go slow, perfect. That was better, freeze after the set. Oh, you don't, you don't need to really run with the arms up. I let you just so you get used to it. I want you to make big steps when you see the ball. Once you get almost under the ball, that's when I want you to prepare your hands. Okay, second thing, when you prepare your hands, I want, imagine, imagine a laser going through, thumbs down, going, going through this. We want that laser that already points up. Laser is going here. Light is going here. Now it's going forward. How would you point up? Yes, okay. So when waiting for the ball, turn that, those hands pointing up instead of forward. Because if I point forward, now when I catch the ball, I have to go up, which is not, you know, not that easy. If I already have my arms prepared going up, the only thing I need to do is extend, okay? the flexibility of the wrist going this way is like... Then open the elbows. The more you open elbows, more, more, more easy it's going to be. If you hold here, then it's really hard. Okay. okay, just open more elbows so you have that motion up. Same thing, okay? All right, so point up with your, with your hands. Up, up. That's nice. You still have more space to slow down. It was slower than usual, but you still have way slower. Hold the finish. It's still kind of like 
for me, what helps the most is you don't want to kind of do it. You want to do it exactly the right way how you want to do it. That means you want to start like this and you want to finish exactly like this. That's when you are happy with your rep. And then you don't care about the ball. The ball is going to slowly start to listen. But if you just focus on the ball and you end up one time like this, one time like this, one time leaning back, then you're not getting that muscle memory. Okay? Try to always just think about the body motion. Okay? Volleyball is mechanics. It's getting used to doing the same motion to get more reps in a row. Nine out of 10, for example. But so practice that motion. I, I want, that's why I said, imagine the picture or show us that if we don't see the ball, that we see what you're doing. Show us that motion. Okay, that's what we're looking for. For us, good repetition is if we see it, not, not if we see the ball. Okay, so let's show it. Nice, perfect set, even slower. Show me super slow. Have you ever watched slow motion? A little too long, faster start. Have you ever watched slow motion? Show me. Okay, and now hands, slow motion. Okay, so keep that speed on the finish. That's the, that's the speed I want, okay? So speed of the slow motion, everything else is moving normal. Hands are going slow motion. Per beautiful, way better, way better. Still, still your hands are a little bit pointing too much forward with your light. Turn that light up, or they would say cheeseburger or a baguette, you know baguette? Okay, so your baguette is supposed to point up instead of forward, okay? So while waiting for the ball, prepare your hands pointing up so now the extension is up, okay? You're allowed, if it's easier, to bring them a little bit on your chin, okay? So instead of holding it on the chest, here it's a little bit too high, you can bring them a little bit higher if it's gonna help you bring the, the light up, okay? So try maybe to start higher. Cat, extend all the way. You start with the bended elbows. That's better. That's better. I like that. I think you didn't extend the elbows all the way. Set was perfect though. Slow. Slow. And from beginning to the, to the whole extension. I like the speed. Make sure you're not going down. Just start higher and then end up up. You did a little bit. Okay. Nice. Uh, so for me, it helped that I just focus on lift. Imagine the set is a lift. You're basically going only up. Okay, so that's why we're waiting low, so we only lift that ball. Okay, let's go. Up with your hands. Extend all the way, not kind of. All the way so I can see your hands are pointing to me. Nice, cat. A little bit more out with your hands. Look. Out. And slow. Good, a little hold in your hands. Finish was good. Good, a little bit more out. Out, out, try to think about that finish. Change things. Again. Again. Give me a ball. Try not to think about positioning, okay? Catch the ball on your chest. Okay, give me a ball again. Move, move, move a little bit and catch on the chest. Okay, again. Okay, now let's try not to have arms, let's try not to have hands going like this and you trying to like land the ball in your hands. Let's just keep your hands close to your body and just catch the ball. Toss me the ball, like catch, okay? And here, like catch, okay? Okay. Okay. So try not to focus too much on positioning in your basket, okay? You want to just let the ball come to you and catch it, okay? I feel sometimes you're late on the set because you're trying to position that it lands in your hands. Catching is the easiest part. You just go and you grab it, okay? And now you're thinking about that extension, okay? So don't try to land the ball in your hands. Just position and catch the ball and then go up. Then do that lift motion. Catch and lift. Good.
good. I still feel, so your start is good. It feels nice. And then I feel in the end, you just, your hands go like this. Okay, does it make sense? It doesn't go like controlled, I'm going here. Okay, I don't see in your hands that you want to go one way. It's just like, does it make sense? That's how it looks for my eyes. So try to like show more, you know, with your hands what you're doing. Show me again, without a ball. Open the thumbs and fingers. Okay, I want that with the ball. Okay, even if you set over the net, I want a little bit, I think your hands are too soft when setting. That's why the ball goes a little bit more. A little bit stronger, but you keep that distance and you go exactly where you want, okay? Nice, but your hands are going here. Where's your target? Yes. Let's try not to go with arms high. Try to go with your arms next to your body. Better, better, I like that. Arms next to here. Yeah. Again, again, arms next to you and then think about the finish. And finish. Better, I like that. Kat, you keep the arms up. Don't listen to what I'm telling uh, Angie. For you, arms up, and then you focus on that finish. Good? It's still the same what I told her. The finish feels like... Be more firm on the finish, both of you. Exactly, toss me a ball. So if I want to set... Exactly that you see where I'm finishing. Firm finish, okay? Not super light, okay? It's slow, but it's not weak. Okay, let's go. Again, 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 again. Extend all the way, show me where you're setting. Good, that's better. Even more, go again. Sorry, babe. Go again, extend all the way with a firm finish. It's still a little bit like this, okay? Good, better, better. Let's go, firm finish, firm finish. Again, that's not a firm finish. Lift and firm finish. Start low, start low, extend all the way, better. Good. All right, let's go, one more each. Face the target, firm finish, firm finish. No, you speed it up. You come to the ball and you're like, Phew. take time, stay connected for seconds. That's pretty good. Go again. Go again. Same, do the same thing, but four seconds. This was three seconds. And again, again. Again, you're chasing the ball. Toss a little bit more middle, babe. That's better. That's better. Every time to the target. Go again. Your arms are most of the time shooting forward. That's why many times you're leaning back because your arms are going here. So to get a height, you're doing this. Open the elbows and go higher with your arms. Okay? So open the elbows so you have the motion, uh, chin up, look up like you're looking the ball. You start here and then you extend here. Okay? When, you, when your elbows are here, the only way that the ball goes up is if we lean back. Okay? We never want to lean back. So open the elbows so you can actually go up with your arms. Okay, that was good, but do you feel, uh, that's the, this what I'm showing. It's not like too loose. You have to still be aware how to control your body. Go again. Open elbows. Good. So now the same thing should be with the extended elbows. So show us the same thing. So right now, this was a good rep. Now extend all the way. Okay, same, same thing how you started. Just extend all the way with the straight elbows. Yes, let's see it. Perfect, perfect. That was good. All right, that was our lesson, guys, for the hand setting. Hope you liked it and that you learned something new. Uh, if you have any questions, leave it in the comments and subscribe on our channel. Uh, we're looking forward to give you more tips in the next video.